Hey guys, welcome back. It's Tamara. It's Friday. And we're here with a Olive Young Korean skincare haul. They are my favorite, my favorite place to shop, period. But my favorite place for skincare, even makeup, body care, like they do it all. Oh, it's so good. It is the Sephora of Korea, if you will. But the prices are not Sephora-like. They're like drugstore, drugstore prices. So we have all of these goodies. And I am so excited. I've had this box sitting here for a little bit, for like a week and a half, and it's been killing me. I wanna try all this stuff. So, welcome if you're new and welcome back if you're not. If all of that sounds good to you, then you should probably <clears throat> grab a drink, grab a snack, get comfy, because we're going to look at a lot of cool shit. What's up, homies? We are back with a video that you probably weren't expecting to see today and certainly a video that I was not prepared to film today. I thought this little skincare video was gonna be my bonus video for the week. God had other plans for me today. Um, I'm probably gonna show you at the end, but our Christmas tree, yeah, she's up. She's decorated. We took a field trip together today, but you wouldn't know it. Uh, we went to Home Goods. we went to TJ Maxx. You guys hung out with me all day and last night. Well, I just transferred all my videos over to my iPad to edit, and your girl hit a button on her camera, and all of the videos from today, except for a couple, were in slow-mo, which, if that was the case, I could fix it. I could speed things up. There was also no sound, so you just see me. Only it was like this. Lord be with me, but thank you, Jesus. We have a box of skincare goodies. We have a haul. I've just been saving it for a bonus video because you know I like to keep our regular scheduled weekday videos to nails because I know that's the main reason you guys are here. But as you know, and I've said this since the beginning, I don't just love nails, I love skincare. I love makeup. I love clothes. I love shopping. I love you. Um, so well, that's what we're gonna do today. We have an Olive Young Hall. Olive Young, if you don't know, like I said in the beginning, in the intro, Olive Young is the Sephora of Korea. But the prices, you guys, shocking. Korean skincare is the best. It is the best. Best ingredients, best prices, cutest packaging, all of it. Like, it's the best. Even makeup. They have good body care hair care like it's amazing it's amazing so just go take a look olive young if you're out there we could use a code okay so we're gonna get into it i've got obviously skincare i actually have a couple nail things that we're gonna be trying out together so let's get into it so i apologize if you're expecting a nail video from me today I do not have time to film a nail video right now because it's already like probably about seven o'clock at night on Thursday. So I don't want to be here all night. My family would not be happy with me. Um, so this is what we get. I know a lot about skincare. I use, if you're new here, I used to be an esthetician. So I am a skincare connoisseur. I don't just know about it. I don't just love it. I used to do it as a job. So I do know things. 
and I've just been obsessed with the beauty industry forever. So, all right, there's a fucking hair, as per usual, on my nose. Thank God I had this box of goodies sitting here to do a haul. Otherwise, I don't. I would be crying right now. I would be crying and screaming because my video's gone, and you guys don't get to decorate my tree with me anymore. It's up. I can't take it back down. Like, I'm not going to take it back down, put it back in the box, and go do, like, we, that's just... So I'll show you guys. How shitty is that? I literally did my first... This hair is driving me actually insane. I did my first video out and about. Out and about with you guys. We went shopping, and it was awkward to say the least home goods was packed but i got some cute footage there was cute stuff i'm so sad you guys okay anyways let's get into it okay let's get into it so where do i set this i'll just set it down here all right first off a couple nail goodies we have from dashing diva they're a nail brand specifically i believe so dashing diva I'm sorry, but this hair, I might have to pause the video. <laughs> um, Dashing Diva, all of this is in Korean, so I can't read it, but I know what it is. Dashing Diva Magic Off. It is a gel a remover. It's supposed to remove your gel very fast. Now, I need to look into this more. We need to play with it more because this brand makes those little gel-like... Um, not fake nails, but like, you know how you can put on like, they're like stickers, but they're gel. I've never used them, but you like put them on your nail, like a nail sticker over the whole nail. And then it like cures on, I think, or something. That's what this brand makes. So I was thinking I could, I swear to God, I'm sorry guys. Okay, I think I got it. Um, I was thinking we could use this as a remover for our like, extensions and things like that which i think you can because it's a gel remover but i think by the smell of it i think it will eat away at the gel it smells like acetone okay so in here you get two little wood pushers but you get it's a dual pack so you get two two then they're so cute two little bottles and yeah it definitely i've i've taken a whiff and I'm like, that smells, gee, many Christmas. Am I gonna be, what the hell? Okay. I mean, it's, oh, you know what? You know what? It almost, I'm, sh it's acetone. It's, it smells like nail polish remover. So it comes in such a cute little bottle. It's just a little squeezy, but... I don't know. I'm going to have to play with it. And if I can find some uh, English instructions, that would be great. Because I'm not really sure. I just, they have like gel removers on there. And the other ones were sold out. So I wanted to get a couple of them and try them out. But when I opened it, I got, I got that whiff. And I'm like, I don't know. It might remove it really good, but uh oh. If you're wanting to save your like gel press ons, like we use, I use the Jello Jello peel off base, and I can pop off my gel nails and reuse them. So if you're wanting to do that, I, I'm guessing this wouldn't be the product for you because it would eat away at the gel. I'm guessing. We're going to play with this because I am curious. Okay, this. Look at how cute this damn box is for one. Focus. Make your ooh magical that's what it says magical nail solution nail hardener strengthener and primer the brand is ooh the box is so damn cute i actually have tried this i opened it because i was sitting here one night and i was like you know what i'm gonna slap that on it's air dry it is i'm trying to like I've been very hard on my nails because I just don't care. <laughs> I'm trying to care. I'm trying to grow them and make them nice. So again, everything, 
No, they do have English instructions. Apply the solution on the center of your nail and dry for 10 to 30 seconds. It's a nail hardener, protector, damage repair, and primer combined. So when it says primer, I'm not sure if that can be for gel products or if it's a primer like, you don't really use a primer for regular nail polish, right? It has been years, like eons and eons, like 25 years since I've used regular nail polish. So I really, I'm pretty sure you don't use a primer maybe like a sticky one sometimes, but so I'm guessing you could use this as a primer for gel. Again, I'm going to have to look into it, but it's really, the bottle is so dang cute and it's like a, like a milky pink color. It smells like nail polish. It smells delicious. Actually, I haven't had that smell in a long time. smells like nail polish. So I used it and I didn't put anything on top of it and it is still on my nails. It was probably like a week ago. It's just leaves like a slight tint and like a little bit of a shine, like a satin. And I can just feel like it's really smooth. So I think like I kind of bought this just to use by itself when, cause I don't have nails on the majority of the time with what I do, like making, uh, making nails all the time and wanting to try them on, my resin stuff. Like it's very hard to have long, I like long nails. It's hard to have long nails and do that. So things we'll be playing with. All right, these I am very excited for. These are a new thing to me. Some of these are re-ups, some of these are brand new. This is from BioHeal, which I really like this brand. And they're the Pro Bioderm Collagen Remodeling Eye Patch. These kept selling out and I finally got them. They came back in stock and I got them. So this is what they look like. I believe these are the type, I don't know if you guys have seen the cool uh, sheet masks. I have a bunch of them, of course. Um, that you put on your skin and you leave on for a while and they end up turning clear because everything like soaks in your skin and then once they turn clear, you take them off. I believe that's like what these are, but for your eyes, it says apply the patch for 20 to 30 minutes, remove and spread remaining essence on your skin. It's got collagen. It's a hydrogel patch. Titans for a youthful look. Yes, please. A gimme, gimme. So this is the container. I'm excited. I've been dying to try these, but I've been waiting. I've been waiting for the haul. So you get a little scooper. So you don't have to dig your grimy little mitts in there. Oh, they look so yummy. Eye patches are amazing because you don't have, like these say 20 to 30 minutes. So that's why I do think that they're that type that kind of like goes see through. Oh yeah. I wonder if you can see this. Okay. Hold on. They're like gummy. Oh my gosh. They're not like, you know, those gel ones that slide off. They're not like that. They're literally like, they look like fabric, the texture, but they're like gummy and so full of juicy essence. Like, Oh, look at that flop. I love a nice flop in a skincare patch. Face mask, eye patch. Oh, yeah. <laughs> These are going to be nice. I am excited. Let me know if you guys want updates of any of this stuff that I haven't tried yet. I will give them to you because I am excited. But yeah, eye patches. Girl, throw those on in the morning. Like before you put your sunscreen on, because I know you're wearing sunscreen every day, whether you're going outside or not. Sunscreen, number one anti-aging thing you could possibly do, wear high SPF sunscreen every day, which I have my favorite one in here that I re-upped on that I've gone through like a million tubes of. Sunscreen, even inside. Your plants, your indoor plants, do they grow inside? Yeah, they do. They're getting sunlight somehow. So is your fucking face. Wear your sunscreen, motherfucker. Wear it. All right. Another new item, also from Bio, is it Bioderm? Yeah, yeah, right? BioHeal, BioHeal. So this I mainly got because it comes with these two uh, sheet masks and I really wanted to try these sheet masks like so badly and they were sold out. So this I came across and it came with two of the sheet masks. Well, I was like, yes score i'm getting them well i think like i mean the the serum also sounds really nice and you get a little free lifting cream so this is the pro bioderm 3d lifting ampule for firmer firmer looking skin reduces signs of aging 
Give it to me. Give it all to me. I will drink it. I will do anything with it. Give it to me. So you get a full size of that, and then you get a mini of the matching little face cream and two of the sheet masks. So this is the serum. I'm not going to open it yet because I still... I like to, once you open your skincare, that's when that clock starts, like the 24 months or whatever it is. So don't open it until you're ready to use it. And then you get two of these sheet masks that just look so cool. So they are 3D lifting full face tension gel masks. They are two parts or three parts. I think they're three parts. I think you have a, a chin strap. Suck up that little turkey in a gobbler. And then you've got a middle face and then a forehead, like right here, forehead. So I believe it's three parts. And it just sounds amazing. Like it's a gel mask. I'm really excited about this. Let me know if you guys are interested in this stuff because I could do, I'm not gonna film at my house cause it's just like, I'm not. Um, but I could bring things here. I could like wash my face here one night or something and we could try this stuff. Let me know, I might, I might be able to do that, we'll see. And then you get a little mini of their 3D lifting cream. Have not tried this either. So I am excited. All of this stuff sounds so good. So, so good. I am very excited to give all of this shot. All right, a re-up. The COSRX Six Peptide Skin Booster. This stuff is so good. I am almost out of my first bottle and honestly, it's a huge bottle. Like they are literally this big. And it is a, it's like a thin, watery serum. Like you would think it was like a essence, but it's a serum. And I use this in the morning. I will use my, is it, I always get these two mixed up, Metaheal or Metapeel. They're cool like toner pads that everybody talks about. I love those. So I'll use like that. And then I will mist my face with this like milky mist that I love. And then I will go in with this so my face is all nice and damp and wet. And then I will pat on this other, this like really good, it's actually French. Um, I think it's Lorisat. It's a, oh my gosh. Why does my brain do this to me? Why? Hyaluronic acid. Good Lord, it's a hyaluronic acid cream. Just another tip, if you're using hyaluronic acid, it needs to go on wet skin or it's gonna dry your skin out. Hyaluronic acid pulls moisture from the air into your skin if your skin is damp. If your skin is dry when you put it on, it will pull the, mo it will pull the moisture out of your skin and pull it into the air. So that's why a lot of people don't like hyaluronic acid because it dries their skin out. They're just using it incorrectly. So I like to do things that like make my skin nice and damp and wet first and then I'll slather it on and it works amazing. So this stuff, great. It's for anti-aging, anti-aging, evening skin tone, hydrating, firmness, smoothing, pore and sebum care, improving skin texture. It does everything. And there's hyaluronic acid in this, amino acids. Peptides are amazing for aging, anti-aging. So this is a, you get two in here. This is a dual pack. And I just wanted to re-up on these bad boys because me likey. All right, let's see what else. Oh, another kind of hand like nail item. Not nail item, but it's a hand item. The Iliun Ceramide Unscented Hand Cream. And you get a full size and then a like deluxe size. It's not a mini, it's still pretty big. I have opened this and I put the mini one in my purse. So good. I am a hand cream connoisseur. Dry skin makes me actually wanna crawl out of my body and leave it. Like I cannot. I've told you guys this before, but if you're new here, I cannot take it. If I don't have, and I always make sure I do, but if I happen 
to like, maybe I don't bring my purse in somewhere and then I have to go to the bathroom and I wash my hands. If I don't have hand cream, we have to go get it. Like I literally, my husband knows this, everybody knows this. I cannot, I will just sit there like freaking the fuck out. I can't take it. I can't take that feeling. I put foot stuff on every night before I go to bed. Like literally I get in bed and I put on the Lush Sleepy Body Cream on my little tootsies. I always am like moisturized, like I'm slippery like a seal and that's how I like to keep it. So hand creams, love them. Thicker the better, not greasy, is so good. So I, like I said, I have tried this and it is so good. This was a new, is it upside down? Yeah, this was a new buy for me. And I am so happy because I love it. So, highly recommend if you like. And it's unscented, so I like that. I don't, like I wear like perfume and nice scented body cream. I don't need my hand cream to smell. I don't like, no. So, 10 out of 10, would recommend, love. And then again, same brand, this is their Ceramide Auto Concentrate Cream. Again, Korea loves to do like, Loves to do, loves to do, oh my gosh. <clears throat> Korea loves to do dual gift packs. They love to do a gift pack over there and I love that. I love a gift pack. So you get two and they're huge. Honestly, I thought these were body creams at first I believe they're head to toe, which is wild. They're unscented, they're seven free, vegan, they have won awards. Um, why am I saying they? It. It has won awards. It, it, ceramides are also very good for your skin, very good for aging. Ceramides, peptides, get them in me. I'll eat them, I'll eat them. They're amazing, so it's huge. Like, I don't know how many ounces this is, but it's probably like, yeah, five ounces. I haven't opened it yet because my face cream is still open, but I am really excited to try this. Like the reviews are really good and it looks very thick. I have dry skin, just should have mentioned that at the beginning. My skin is pretty dry. I have always had normal skin. I've never had like oily skin or really dry skin, but now I use tretinoin which can dry out your skin. It 100, like it always dries out your skin. So my skin is dry now. I need all the moisture I can get. I right now am using the Etude. The one, I did a Korean like skincare favorites video like a few months ago. Still using that. Most of that stuff in there, I think I'm all, I'm using all of it. I, I love it. So the Etude Soon Jung Cream. It's so good and it's so cheap. So I kind of want to try this and see if it stands up to that and if I like it. Might use it for my face, might use it for my body, might use it for both. We shall see. It says stuff on the back, but I can't read it, but it looks good. It's got a graph that says 91.4%. So I don't know. I don't know what they're talking about there, but I'm sure it's good things. All right, let's see. Here's a re-up. The Tacobo Lavender Flower. It's a collagen brightening eye gel cream. It has lavender flower water, 81%. Vegetable collagen, 1000 ppms. I assume that's quite a bit. I don't know what a ppm is, but quartz jewel water, 1000 ppms. D-panthenol, 1000 ppms. Good stuff, good stuff. Basically it's very hydrating and it's a gel and it's purple. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna show you guys. I, I did, I ran out of my one so I get to open this. Look at how freaking cute this is. Like it just makes you wanna use it. So how I use, cause like I said, I have dry skin so I gel would not be enough for me. I use this similar to how I would use this is I use it under my eye cream morning and night because whenever your skin is damp, any moisturizing stuff you're throwing on top of it loves that. So when you're putting on your face cream, hyaluronic acid, um, eye cream, anything like that, if your skin can be a little damp, that's why I love face mists, essences, 
all that good stuff. I always have my face a little bit damp before I put on everything else because that really pulls in the moisture. So that's how I use an eye gel. I put the eye gel, do, 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 do. I put all of my eye stuff around my mouth too, like my little smile lines and above my lip and right here, all around here. So it's a little damp. I don't, I don't like rub it all the way in. You always want to tap boop, 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 with your ring fingers. You don't want to pull. Tap, 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 tap. And then I will go with my eye cream and put that on. Amazing. So that's how I use this. And it's just so cute. I mean, even the box, all of it. Just, Korea just knows, they know what they're doing. Okay. All right. These are also a re-up. Love these. I love these. Okay, so these are the VT Riedel Shot 1000 Two Step Mask. Now, I gotta tell you what a Riedel Shot is because you're probably like, what the fuck? Or maybe you know. They are, so this picture right here, this bottle, they make different strengths of what's called a Riedel Shot Serum. Basically, it's like a, the texture of it's almost like a light, like, gel moisturizer. I swear all these little hairs are just floating around trying to ruin my video. Um, so, it's these little serums, little serums, these serums, are full of what's called radles, and it's basically like... It's like microdermabrasion, not microdermabrasion. Uh, oh my gosh, why does my brain do this to me? Fuck. The thing where they stamp your face. Oh, Lord be with me. I gotta look it up. BRB, I hate myself. Microneedling. Lord be with me. <sighs> why I couldn't remember that, but we know how my brain works. So, microneedling in a serum. Basically, it's just full of all these things called riddles that when you massage on your skin, you feel like it doesn't hurt, but it feels like you can feel it, like it's like zingy, you know, like because it's getting it, the shapes of, I believe they're called specules, the shapes of them are able to like get down deeper into your skin. So then whatever you put on afterwards, has access to also follow them and get deeper into your skin so everything works better. It's an amazing thing, it really is. Like this skincare ingredient, Specules, is genius, whoever thought of it. So that's what Riedel Shot is, is they have different strengths of the serum and I have, they have like, I believe it starts at 100, 300, 700, 1,000. I have the 300 strength. So you use it every third night. So I'll use like tretinoin, tretinoin, Riedel shot. Tretinoin, tretinoin, Riedel shot, and so on. And, oh, it's amazing. It's amazing. So the mask, this is a 1,000 strength. This one's like crazy. Like you can really feel it. So you put this on, that's the thousand riedel shot. And then you put this like creamy moisturizing milky mask on top of it. And it just like, oh, it is the, I, it's probably like the most effective mask because of this riedel shot. Like I love it. So I bought a couple of these before. I bought three more. I wish they would sell box sets of these. So that, so I could buy a box of them because I would, but yeah, they're so good. Try a Riedel shot, try it. It's great for like anything, like hyperpigmentation, anti-aging, all of it, anything you can think of. Like it just, because anything you put on after your like Riedel shot serum works way better. It's so good, it's so smart. I just love it, I love it. Okay, all right, next. My favorite sunscreen ever. Beauty of Josen. What is it called? Relief Sun Rice Plus Probiotics. It is so good. So it is SPF 50 plus PA plus 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 plus. Basically, the sun ain't getting in, motherfucker. Not here. Not here, not here, and not here. I am protected. I stay strapped. 
with this. I can't legally be strapped with other things, so sunscreen it is. My protection. So I already took one out because I was out. But you get this tube. It is so freaking good. It is like a milky, it's not really thick. It's like a like a medium milky consistency and it is moisturizing. It is so good. It's not greasy. Like a lot of like like American made sunscreens are like thick, white, um, very greasy. And the SPF is like SPF 30. Why would I want that? Like why? I don't see the point. Get the highest SPF because that's the longer it's gonna last on your skin. That's the longer the SPF will last, is the higher the strength. I don't know of many, if not any, I'm sure there's a couple, but SPFs made in the United States that have all the extra like plus, 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 PA plus, like this is a Korean, Koreans do sunscreen better than anybody else. And they do most things better than anybody else because their freaking skincare is so good. So yeah, this is my favorite. My second favorite, I forget what it's called. It's really good too. But this is number one. This is, again, dual pack. You get two. It's amazing. Amazing. Highly recommend. All right. And another re-up. This is the Riedel Shot. So we have the Riedel Shot 300, right? Yeah, 300. So this is what I was just talking about. I am still on the first one. Sorry, the bottle or the box is shiny. I, um, I'm still using the first one. So when it runs out, I will have a re-up because I don't want to run out of this shit. It is so good. Again, it doesn't have instructions on, in English on here, but, oh, it does. Use at the first step of skincare every three days. Like I said, so you don't want to use it more than that or you will irritate your skin and ruin your little skin barrier. So every three days, first step, because then everything you put on afterwards, what will it do? It will work better. It will sink in further. Yeah, that's it. It will do amazing things. So I love this stuff. Again, if you are an experienced skincare person, you might want to start at the 100 is the lowest, 300 is the next. So this is the 300. It's still like pretty strong, like I can feel it. So I would definitely maybe start at the 100 if you're like getting into skincare. Otherwise try the 300. Works great. All right, another re-up. You guys, I can't live without this stuff. And I'm so happy I'm finally doing this video because I have been out and I tried a very popular very popular that everybody seems to love cleanser that I thought I would love because it is specifically for dry skin because it's full of glycerin. I will try to remember to put it in the video because I cannot remember what it, what the brand is. But the brand is very popular. This is just the only thing I think I've tried from them. Um, my skin feels dry after I use it. Not dry, but it is not as moisturizing as my baby. I have been through so many bottles of this. So this is the Isentree Yam Root Vegan Milk Cleanser. And you get the full big pump bottle. It's like this big. It's, yeah, well, I can open it. Um, it's a big bottle and you get a refill pouch. So you can refill your bottle. So you get a shit ton of product. Look at how huge this is. It is creamy, milky, like goodness. I love this. I love using this to wash my face. It just feels so good. And then you get a little refill patch, patch, pouch. So you get that. It, this is the only cleanser, and boy have I tried a lot, that has not left my face dry after I use it. I hate that feeling, as I'm sure you could guess, when you wash your face and then your face is like <sighs> until you put stuff on it. Like, I hate that. This does not do that. And it is the only cleanser. It doesn't do that. So I will keep buying it. The other one, the glycerin one, I guess I'll use it on my body or something because like it, it does make my skin feel a little bit tight after I use it. And I'm shocked. 
I was. I was shocked because everybody with dry skin like raves about this cleanser and glycerin is very good for dry skin. It's the same thing as like hyaluronic acid. You need to put it on wet skin and it works so much better. So make your skin all nice and damp. And then any glycerin stuff, amazing. So good. All right, last thing guys, last thing. A new sheet mask. I have never tried this before. I think it's brand new because I kind of stock that site and I have never seen this before. So. Neuroderm M Biome Repair Lifting Cream Mask Pack. Sounds like right up my alley. So you leave it on for 10 to 20 minutes. This is also three pieces. How crazy is that? Normally masks are either one or two. Both of these that I got are three. That is so crazy. So it's the same thing. Neck, lower face, upper face. Skin elasticity, high elastic poly, polyurethane sheet. I'm guessing, I have not tried it yet. Oh, I, yeah, I haven't tried it yet, but I opened it. Um, I'm guessing it's like a very like milky, yummy skin mask. Skin mask, sheet mask. That's what I'm guessing because that's what I love. My favorite sheet masks are the, ugh. I'm gonna have to try to remember to put it on the screen. It's milk something, like, milk something. But they are like thick, bouncy, stretchy, silky, milky sheet masks. It just feels so good. Those are the sheet masks that I love. The milky, like they're very thick and milky and they feel so nice. Those are the ones that I like. I don't like like the really thin ones that are like, you can't stretch them and it's, I don't like those. Give me all the milky bouncy ones. All right guys, that is it. I am so sorry that you didn't get a nail video for your Friday. I hope this works. I hope you're not mad at me, but I couldn't do anything about it. I couldn't, or I would. I would have fixed it. So at least you're getting a video. I hope you love it. I'm sorry, guys. Don't be mad at me. I love you guys. Oh, I'm gonna show you the tree. I'm gonna show you the tree. At least, it's the least I can do. All right, guys. There it is. I am so sad that my video didn't work because we had fun decorating it. Look at the tree topper. I got that at Home Goods today with you guys, but you wouldn't know it because you'll never see that video. I got these cute little bows there. Obviously we have our crybabies hanging up. I got that little thing. That's not a, that's not a tree ornament. I just stuck it in there. I got that at Target along with these cute little opal dangly things. And yeah, they're so cute. Everything else I got at Home Goods, the candy canes, the balls, those balls, also these hot pink balls, but I forgot to get like a ribbon to hang them up with, so they're gonna sit there. This used to be my little backdrop when I first started YouTube, so we're using that as a tree skirt. And then look at how cute she is. Ah, I'm obsessed with her, and then yeah, all the crybabies. All the crybabies. I'll just interchange the crybabies from my purse when I want to switch them out. And then we got this lovely man, this lovely gentleman. I got him at Target. He, my plan with him is to graffiti him. What do you guys think? I need to graffiti him. He would look so dope. He's pretty big. So yeah, I'm so sad that I did this alone now, but Turned out really cute. I hope you guys like it. I thought my tree was gonna be bigger than this, actually. I thought it was gonna be like to right here. <laughs> She's a baby, but that's okay. She's very cute. And then I also got, let's see, what else did I get? Oh, oh yeah, you guys missed this. So I opened this candle, or no, excuse me. I got this candle, I bought it today with you guys. And then we came back to my studio to do a haul and I showed you that. And then I was opening stuff that I got a couple weeks ago and guess what I got? Let me show you. Let me show you. Right there. You literally in real time saw 
my insanity. I bought two of them and I didn't know it. <laughs> Lord be with me. And then I got this cute tree that obviously lights up, but I need to get batteries for her. And then everything's a mess in here. Don't judge me right now. Don't judge me ever, but everything's a mess. And then look at, look at her. I believe she's a cookie jar, but she's just going to be a decoration. So freaking cute. I think I got something else. I got other stuff, I swear. I got that candle. This. Um, 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 look at how messy it is in here. I'm trying to think of what else I freaking got. Oh, yeah. So remember. No, you wouldn't remember because it was in a video that is never going to see the light of day. But I told you guys. This is obviously going bye-bye because Halloween's over, but maybe we'll find a Christmas one. But I wasn't like, I didn't think we probably would. But look at, don't mind my dirty little makeup bag. Look at her. Ah. Isn't she adorable? Adorable. All right, guys. I think that is officially, that's it. That's all I got. So I'm so sorry that you didn't get to decorate with me today or go shopping with me. I can't believe I did all that for nothing, uh, but we'll try it again another day. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell so you know when I post. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you very, very soon. Bye guys! <laughs>